the, the fallacy that can happen with students or kids who are raised in like a self-directed kind of model is um, entitlement and kind of mm. individualism that is so it's like, well, I don't want to do that. So I'm not going to. And that's the mm. attitude and that we see that too, but trying to balance that with, but it, you're not by yourself. You're not just doing this. It's not all about you that you're in a community. And so you have a civic responsibility. You have to understand how you impact other people. You have to mm. know that sometimes you have to do things you don't want to do because the outcome is desirable. And if that outcome is community that thrives, a school where people want to be because mm -hmm. it's, you know, compassionate, caring place. Um, right. we can't, we can't litigate compassion, but yes. we can <laughs> certainly advocate for the fact that we're, you know, we're in this together and that person, you might not like them. They might not be your best friend, but they have a right to be here just as much as you do. And mm -hmm. we have to figure out how to coexist and be a benefit to our school that, that provides this space. This is the Agentic Schools Podcast, where you will learn about schools from around the world where children's agency to make decisions about their learning and living is more important than their academic skills. I'm your host, Don Berg. <laughs>